What's up guys, so I'm Ninja Wang, a and the Superman have bring you yet another episode of Combat for Dummies here on the Modern Ninja channel. Now, guys, this time we're going into something a little harder, uh, definitely requires some of the earlier videos I've done before on this channel, and it is the, <clears throat> excuse me, it is the Double Staff Figure 8. So just as a side note, I was thinking, uh, do you guys want me to start having merch? Would you guys want me to do that? If so, let me know down in the comments what you would want to wear, whether it's a, uh, a rebel hat or the modern ninja jacket or something like that. So let me know down in the comments. I can definitely uh, th get that into consideration. All right, so like I said, this is gonna be a very hard video, especially considering if you haven't had a lot of bow stats practice in the, uh, the previous episodes or just in your life in general. So if you don't get it at first, don't fret. This is a challenging technique. Now, one of the biggest things that I could advise, you don't have to do this, I just strongly advise, if you're gonna do go double bow staffs, either buy two of the exact same bow staffs or go out to Lowe's like I did, buy two dowel rods, cut them to the exact same length, put your tape on so you get your grip, and the, it, that way it's the exact same uh, weight. Because having two off-weighted or different length bow staffs suck, guys. It's, it's, it's horrible. So with that said, definitely get you two exact same weight. Now, for the double figure eight that you've seen in my videos, it's gonna be two figure eights just like this, except it's gonna be more hand rolls. So, Go back and check out that hand roll video before. If just for a quick catch up, that's hand roll one, hand roll two, and this is your figure eight hand roll, just like this. The reason this is important to know is because we're gonna add in the second one. So the second one is not, nothing's changed. Nothing's changed. It's gonna be the exact same hand roll going forward, turning around, and then going backwards. Now the difference is you're gonna offset when you do your hand rolls. Forward, forward 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 and as you go backwards you're doing the same spin as you were doing before you just have to get used to using both hands at the same time guys this is not easy i know it looks relatively easy in the video but guys this takes a lot of hand-eye coordination a lot of focus so try it a couple times if you don't get it keep trying go back to just doing the one if you need to go back to just doing the one just till you get used to doing the one and then you can go into both. Don't skip step. This is not easy again. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Let me know if I should do more of these challenging double bow stuff things, uh, combinations and tricks and stuff like that. If you want to see more of those, definitely let me know down in the comments that you want to see more double staff. Uh, until next time, my name is DJ Moore. This is the Modern Ninja, and I'm out.